Hello everybody, my name is Kip Create, and today I'm going to be playing Submerged. Now I'm not entirely sure what to expect out of this, this is something I found off of a sale on Steam. Uh, it was running for a pretty good deal, can't remember how much it went for, but it was pretty cheap, I think it was like a two bucks maybe. But it looks interesting, and it's kind of like a little puzzle platformer. I guess kind of like a stowaway thing. The graphics are nice. Looks, I can't tell if that's like an ancient city or maybe. It looked like there was like a skyscraper in the distance. Yeah, there's like a little water tower there. So, I mean. Maybe it's like ancient civilization. Like an older. So, yeah, there's a radio tower there. There's like all these temple structures. So, it's like. like a something got blasted back to the stone age and then built on top of that kind of big binish but I don't know I have a feeling this is like set in Italy or something like that that that's what it makes me think it's maybe something like Venice okay, a little bit of texture clipping on the water there but it's kind of neat Oh, whoa, what's with this stomach? He doesn't look good. Looks like they're kids. Oh yeah, he does not look good. Yeah, the character models could be better, but they're they're all they're fairly decent. <clears throat> nice little look around the world. So there's there's an engine on that, so I mean, I don't know. Can I run here? Can I jump? What can I do? I can look at the controls real quick. Uh, postcard? Huh. Or what's going on here? Do I? Guess I set him down here. Is this gonna be cutscene based? Reminds me of that one game that was out a while ago, the Epo game or something like that. IPO IMO. Hmm. Okay, so since the story time is gonna be very kind of hieroglyphic, so. In a little floating city, at home with the family. I'm guessing the parents are dead. Probably, probably like a city collapse or something. Uh, I'm guessing their brother and sister or something. And wow, yeah, he he is uh, not doing well. Oh, okay. That's not English. I have no clue what to make of that. Please tell me there's something for subtitles. Maybe in graphics? Hmm. Because I'd really like to understand what's being said, so. Ah. His name's Taku. I know it's his. Can't really click anything, get any more detail out of that. Okay, I know that I need something, but. But what? What do you want me to do? Tear the page of the book? Can't really do anything if you don't tell me anything. What do you want from me? 
It's not a blanket. Why don't we just wrap that around him? Cinch it up real tight. You got a scarf. You can just do a tourniquet. Need something to stop the bleeding. What around here? What I stop the bleeding with? I mean, imagine if I were plant savvy, I could probably do something with the vines. Oh, okay, there's something on the boat, I suppose. The aura stared at the sun. Oh, no, 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 yeah, yeah, what we're gonna do is climb the tower and grab one of those flags, bring that down, and hope he doesn't bleed to death by then. Yeah, I need to boat over and climb that building. My god, is that, that's actually what we're going to do. glad it lets you park it because there's no way I'd be able to just is it really going to make me climb it grab the flag and there's a freaking blanket under the guy and I guarantee you he doesn't need the blanket um can I jump I can jump Also, she's got some hops and... Oh, boy. Still, I can't believe this is her initial reaction. Oh, no, no, don't use the blanket under him. Don't... Don't do anything like that. Don't do anything that would be logical. No, we have to... We have to go... In this boat... Across the freaking ocean... And you know what we're going to do? We're going to climb this building to pull the flag off of the building. That's intelligent. Nice, I got a symbol of something. Yeah, that, that paper is going to be freaking useless. All things considered, I will need that journal to light on fire. But no, I'll probably go across the sea and grab a boat. Or there's something on top. Is there something on top of the building? Whatever it is, it's not worth it. Like, just being completely honest. I mean, I suppose there could possibly be supplies up here. But the literal only thing up here I can see is, is these flags. Also, there's no real urgency to what's going on here. I mean, my brother is bleeding. My, my little brother right here is bleeding out. Here I am. Yeah, there's no way you saw any of this. There's literally no way you saw that. Cool. I've got an emergency ration and, you know, everything to make him die a little less. Which is nice. Except the fact that in the time it took me to do that, I could have bound his wounds with the friggin' blanket he's lying on. Instead of leaving him to bleed out while I climb a building. I'm sorry, that, that's just a logical fallacy that really, really bothers me. Oh no, we have something to at least bind the wound. But no, let's climb a building. Yeah, I guess he was... Sorry. Okay, so their father was a uh, fisherman. I'm guessing he probably crashed or got lost at sea or some, something like that. Oh, really? You're in pain? Really? I wonder if it has to do with that... You need to find more of those crates. 
Oh, no, no, I'm sure your uh, magic flag vision will will help you there. My god. Oh. I magically have a telescope now. Thank you for telling me exactly where to look. Cool. I mean, that's that's kind of helpful. Hi, little brother. Uh, don't die in this wilderness. Jesus Christ, the turning sensitivity is crazy. Uh, I'm, it's... Shit, where is it? Is up there, right? I can't tell the turning sensitivities. Wait, whoa, what the hell? Is something here? Really? I, I, I stole their motor. I just found this sunken ship and I thought, eh, I don't need it. Princess and the Golem. That doesn't sound ominous at all. If you can't tell, I am not greatly enamored with this situation. It's a nice little platformer. It is. And I get that this is a kid, but damn, this is stupid logic. Like, really? Like, the best thing you had was let me leave my brother completely alone, completely unattended. I mean, there's not really a whole lot of choice there, but at the same time, there wasn't any better option. I don't know what those are, but they better not move. So I love how it wouldn't let me move there without clearly telling me what the limits of the vegetation are. I'm not I'm not imagining it's gonna let me in these buildings. Ooh, got another symbol thing that will probably be completely useless to me. Also, I can't jump, I can only walk around. Nice. Oh no, I need to get back on and walk around. Come on, get a hold. And this girl's got stamina, that's for sure, but... Not so much that this vegetation is... Un unbelievably thick. I mean, this is meme levels of thickness here. I love it whenever games kind of, you know. Oh, no, you probably weigh, you know, 100. You know, you probably weigh. She probably weighs, like, somewhere between, I'd say, 70 and maybe 90 pounds. Maybe. And I, I'm betting that most vegetation ain't going to be able to hold that much just 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 my expert opinion okay 
I'm here stuck with okay I can I can grab that apparently okay I, I want I want you to that's all no she literally got off and looked back with literally fingertips holding her onto that no uh, uh no there are strong people but then there's just some random little girl there is someone walking there and I am very sure he's not going to be friendly Okay, you know, you get back out here. I saw you. I saw you. I know you exist. I'm not sure if you can die in this game. Uh, can I crouch? Can I hide? Can I do a not be seen? Because I would rather not be killed. Uh, mm -mm, there is just run like hell. Um, suppose I can hope he's not here to kill me. I mean, I can hope so, but I imagine it's just going to be like, Hey, this guy found you. You're, uh, dead. Just, it's just how it goes. Uh-uh, no, you have rope burn like nothing else, and you are not grabbing more ledges. Uh-uh, no. Not how this works, honey. You, 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 you done, you hurt yourself. You hurt yourself real good. And trust me, it did hurt. Oh no, no, oh no, no. The, the little the little flowers that they're fine to grab on, but no, no, not the not the big kudzu. C certainly not, no. I, I hope I'm not sounding too negative for anything. This is a very interesting game, and I, I very much like what I'm seeing so far. It's just some of these... I love game logic. Did he just... Did he just... Did that guy just, just straight up just jump it? Oh, hey, there's another little zip line thing. Oh, that's what I'm supposed to grab onto is... That, you know, I'm, I'm just supposed to just jump up the wall. That, that, that's... That's cool. That makes sense. Nothing wrong with that. Uh-uh, no. Especially with that sound that's making. This, the, that's, that's grinding your hands against steel cable. Jesus Christ, no, that doesn't work. Ow, pain. Like, if anyone's ever actually, like, grasped a steel cable, especially considering that these things are probably pretty ancient, yeah, that, that thing's probably, like, an old frayed steel cable. Metal splinters. Okay, yep, I definitely not a friendly guy. But, Jesus, those steel cables, uh, they'll fuck you up. They will fuck you up real good. Real good and painful. <sighs> yeah, he's not doing good. You, uh, you may not like this, but you probably want to cauterize it because I'm pretty sure he's getting infected. Okay, so someone went fishing and drowned in a storm. Cool. Cool story, bro.
Well, I guess we need to find more crates. And it seemed to make sense. Need something for a taco to drink. You have a fire? I imagine you have a can somewhere or can easily find a can in these ruins. Take some of this water, put it on the fire, boil it, get the salt out. Boom. Drinkable water. It's amazing. It's also amazing how hard this thing is to freaking drive. My god. I well, know I'm supposed to find something somewhere. Is that someone tied underneath a billboard? Does not bode well with me. Also, I get the distinct feeling that I'm supposed to go... ...back somewhere. Because it's not telling me anything. I'm figuring it wants me to head back this area, but I'm not sure. Again, there is a water tower right over there, so I mean, that could be a thing. I'm not entirely sure where it wants me to go. Is that like some kind of mutated whale? I don't like it. Also don't like that I have no clue where I'm supposed to... What the fuck is that? Okay, that's a water tower. Oh, hey. What the... No, I don't like it. Because honestly, that like that tells me nothing. Great, I have a picture of a whale. Thank you. Okay, so I guess it's like there's a certain amount of boat boosts around. What is that? Okay, there's dolphins around too. Because imagine I was supposed to be able to see most things from my home base. At least theoretically, but I don't. And I don't want to use my boost just yet to get around quicker, because. Yeah. Anyway, it's really sad that I'm sitting here in a friggin' flooded ocean world. And I, and I have to find water. 
I don't like that sound. Not one bit. Is there something here? I mean, there's there's like there's cans. There there's cans. I have everything I would need to make some purified water. But no. No, I have to do this the stupid way. Hey, get in the boat and then do what? Where? No, I don't want that. I don't care about that. I want... I want friggin' water. That's what I want. The water's actually bluer over there. In an area which I might imagine would be an edge of a map sort of place. Also a sprint feature would be nice. Yeah, hold on there, dying kid. I, uh... I, uh, failed to be able to locate any source of water in the ocean. Because apparently your survival is dependent on me somehow just out of out of the blue finding a stash of bottled water. In other words, holy crap. You're screwed. Oh, that was the first building I climbed. There's probably nothing there. I mean, I know that's, that's going to be a boat repair thing or something. I imagine it has to be back in the area over by the sign. It's just that... It's giving me nothing. I mean, here's a freaking water tower here. But no. Mm, no, that'd be too easy. Okay, cool. There's something about flying fish bird things. Um, no water. No, I, I like open world games. I like games that just kind of, you know, let you work at your own pace. But I don't like just being told, you know, hey, fuck you, figure this out. Hi, you, you're in an ocean world. Find water. Like, fuck you very much. Like, I would have appreciated having just a direction. I guess I'll just climb this thing, because maybe. Cool. Was there any... Is there anything? Anything at all? Please be water. What is that? Secret. I don't care. I don't want a secret. I want friggin' water. What? This is bullshit. I've got to find water in a fucking ocean world. Hey, 
Fuck you. Like, can I please have at least an implication of where I'm supposed to go? This game seems really nice, but I have no clue what the fuck is going on, where I'm supposed to go. I have the most basic idea of what I'm supposed to do. All the story of it is written in friggin' hieroglyphs. So it's just like, how the fuck am I supposed to know? Cool, I have stuff on a map. That's nice to know, but I would really... Because all things considered, this is going to be a big friggin' map. <laughs> Which is cool and all, but... I need water. Please be a case I can do something with. Nope. Never mind. That looks like something is on fire. Either that or... But watch... F thank you for the cutscene after I pass something, but cool. Well, at least mosques survived. The friggin' apocalypse. I suppose we should be thankful for that. I'm going to be completely honest, though, I have absolutely no clue where I'm supposed to go. I am so lost. Well, there was a deli store n nearby. I mean, seriously, what am I supposed to do? I don't even know. I mean, it'll tell me if I'm near something. But I have to be, like, right up on it. Gam, help. I'm glad this isn't me and this is my situation. My brother would be dead. Dead as fuck. Also, is that a... Is that old... Is that like a friggin' spire of some kind? Very nice environment and everything. Too bad I'll never be actually be able to go inside of these buildings. That would be really nice. <sighs> Wish I knew where I was supposed to go. I really do. But... Seems I'm not allowed to have such satisfactions, so... Suppose I shall... Go back... Okay. I'd also have capsized this boat about a million times. But my god... The lack of direction in this game is pretty bad. In any case, I'm going to end this episode right here. While I definitely don't look up answers and whatnot, but uh, 
hope you enjoyed this because it looks like it's going to be a bit of a little bit of a series. So uh, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it, like, subscribe, and share, and you all have a good day.